Hey Collective, this is Nikki. I'm here to do a timeless reading for you today. I hope it resonates. Take what you need and leave the rest. I'm just saging the area, saging the cards. Wanting this to be a good reading for you all. Take what you need and leave the rest. Don't forget you all, if you haven't already done so, like, subscribe, and share. Okay, for some reason, a lot of my uh, subscribers are being unsubscribed. So I don't know what's going on with YouTube, but I lost like 200 subscribers over the last couple of days. I don't know what's going on. So please check your subscriptions. If you are a regular watcher, please, I'd appreciate that. You may have to uh, unsubscribe and, and subscribe again. Okay. So I'm going to ask a question here. Okay. Uh, what is your ex doing with their current partner? What is your ex doing with their current partner? You may not care. You may not care, but we'll see what's going on. Okay, spirit guys, give me messages for the collective in this timeless message. What is going on with your ex's partner in their relationship? Okay, what is going on in your ex's current relationship? Oh, tower. Mm. Tower. Going through some trouble, your ex. What is your ex going through with that person, please, spirit guide? Collective, what is your ex going through with their partner? Something happened or will happen. Six of Cups, okay. Okay, so they got the Tower and the Six of Cups. Maybe their ex went back to the, their ex. Maybe went back to somebody else, okay. And this is like your ex is going through what they took you through. Your ex left you for somebody else. Now, their person they are with left them to be with their ex. Karma is a bitch, 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 bitch. What's going on with your ex and their partner, please? Okay, yeah. Six of Swords. They left. Somebody left them. Okay? For somebody who they felt was their was their tent was their their one. Who they felt were their was their one. And now they're feeling like like they treat you like damn, you know. Um, they're so messed up right now. Okay, because whoever they left you for left them to be with somebody else. Because they didn't want, they didn't think that the per they didn't think that your ex made them happy, so they went somewhere else to find their stability, love, and everything else in between. So your ex is about to get stung in the butt if they already haven't. Okay, because we got the tower card. That's the that's they're about to be bet they're about to be devastated if they already aren't. Okay, so I'm gonna shuffle. But the bottom of this deck I have here is unfounded fear, expecting a worse. Thus, creating self-fulfilling prophecies, allowing worry to grow out of proportion to this to the situation. Sleepless nights and refocus your thoughts. So your person is really, really regretful. It's like this person is finally somebody, you know, universe has finally pulled your person's whole card. Now they know what you went through. OK, and turn around is fair play. OK, what is that saying? Fair exchange is no robbery. Your person's going through some mess because their person left them. OK. And went back and that was justice like like for what they did to you that's karma so yeah they got left and that person who they were went with found their their wish fulfillment elsewhere okay so they felt like they were shafted your ex felt like they were shafted and now they're in their mind you know arguing back and forth with this person why you leave me and they're thinking in the back of their mind they left you I left my chick or my man to be with you and you didn't just left me or did me wrong or cheated on me and lied to me they want they found their happiness elsewhere. Your person wasn't it. Your person was not their happiness. Okay. So if you're if you're still watching now, if you watch me on a regular basis, you know I started the job this past Monday. So I'm going to still do the 12 signs weekly, but I'm going to break them down. I'm going to do three a night starting Monday. Next Monday, I'm going to do three signs a night. Uh every night I'm going to do three signs. I'm going to do that consecutively every week. I'm just going to, to switch the schedule maybe Monday it'll be it'll be the fire signs Tuesday it will be the earth signs and so on and so forth until I get them all done because I can't do them all at one and all in one day not right now now with me trying to get used to this new work schedule from 8 30 to 5 or whatever and my daughter she's sick so I have to deal with her she's back there in her room sneezing right now so I'm hoping she's not sick sick but yeah but anyway so yeah I'm just going to stagger <clears throat> the readings for the the all the 12 signs but if you have a uh, personal reading if you schedule it with me I'll try to get that done within seven days okay seven days all right so we're gonna get started here finish all right what's going on with your ex and their person 
Huh, decisive, focus, driven, and defensive. Events that move at great, spree, great speed. So your person, they're, they're having to review their options wisely because this happened out of the blue for them. Kind of like it happened out of the blue for, for, for you when they left you or ghosted you or whatever. Hmm, I see a cardinal. Wow, I see a cardinal bird here, okay? Um, right there, you see that cardinal bird? That's a confirmation for me. I've been seeing cardinal birds all over the place since my mother passed by and, and passed away rather. So maybe that was maybe that was right. Her just passing by here in the cardinal. But anyway, that's just a side note. But I've just been seeing cardinals everywhere since my mother passed away. Wow. Okay, I'm sorry. That caught me off guard, y'all. <laughs> but yeah, um, your person, the relationship between your ex and their person is dead. Okay, it's gone. It's over with. What's going on between your ex and their person? A brilliant experience, uh, humorous and judgmental. Releasing situation or people that no longer serve you. So they left, they divorced or 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 separated from this individual, your ex, because they don't they no longer serve their needs. They got from your person whatever they needed to get, and then they dropped their ass like a hot potato. Drop, drop, drop. Hmm. Okay, we have two that fell out. Brilliant, talented, independent, and controlling. There is nothing you can't do. Believe in yourself. Never underestimate your ability to make your dreams come true. So they thought that that, that they were leaving you to go make their dreams uh, come true with somebody else. And they got dissed. They got dismissed by the queen of swords. Dismissed. Okay? Taking the next steps, bold and ambitious, ambitious choices. Partnering with others who share your dreams, exp expanding your plans. This man or woman is going to continue to move forward in their life. They probably will knock on your door to see what you're up to or go to somebody else completely or whatever. Because their life right now is, is turned topsy-turvy. <clears throat> and they don't know what they're going to do. But they bought, it, uh, they, they, bought it against, they bought it to themselves. Whatever's going on here, they did it to themselves. You know, justice has spoken. Clarify the tower person for your ex. <laughs> Terrify. Clarify the tower card for your ex, please. What are they going through right now with this tower card? Seven of Wands. So this person is holding themselves back because they don't have any other. They felt this person felt that they should have come have to. They felt that they should have covered their heart, protected their heart a little bit more because they didn't see this coming. You know, they can hurt people, but they don't expect for people to hurt them. Okay, so we got the Four of Cups. Okay, they realize now what they did to you, all the, the calling and, and no, not texting, not returning phone calls. Now they know how it, how it feels to be shafted, to be said, uh, well, I don't want to talk to you anymore. There's nothing that we have to say. I've made up my mind or not to say anything at all. They just walked away. They're getting what they're getting what, what they did to you in tenfold. Okay, so if you ever worried about this person or tripped off this person, what they did to you is coming back on them. They're in their feelings now with this Queen of Cups, and they're hurting right now. Okay, they may try to make a move. We have the Seven of Cups. So you have, but you are living your life, doing the things that you need to do to survive and thrive in your life. You're not tripping off that person anymore. Okay, but this person, we got the King and the Queen of Cups. They're hoping that you still feel for them. But see, they left you out in the cold. This is them. Okay, this is you. You know, moving on with your life or whatever. But this is them. They left you out in the cold, but now they want to come back and, and talk. Now they want to come back and talk. And two, just to see where you are in your life, to see what you're doing now that they didn't got dismissed. You know, Christmas is coming. They may say, well, hey, send you a Christmas card or whatever. I'm just wondering how you're doing or a, a Christmas meme or whatever to see how you're doing. Okay. Will your person contact you since they got this? Will your ex contact you now that they are no longer in a relationship? That part popped out. We got the hermit. They surely thinking about it. Will your person contact you? Three. They're, they're thinking about trying to figure out a way to contact you to figure out how we can work this. Can we work, can we work on this? Can we fix this? Now they want to fix it with you with the ace of cups. Okay. They want to come back and give you this huge, this huge offer. Can we do this again? Show me how to love you. I shouldn't have to show you how to love me after all of this time. They realize now that they're looking back that they really did and truly love you. 
I just think that's, that, that, that's a way for them to get back in because it's getting ready to get cold outside. They just need a warm body in the bed. See, they hurt. They want to come back. This person is hurting from what that other person did to them. You know, they walked away. Now they want to come back to you and work it out because they can't nurse their own heart. They can't nurse their own broken heart, so they're coming back to you. Hmm. Hmm. Tell them to go fuck a duck. Okay. King of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles. They want to come out and come back and finally offer the missing pieces that's going to make you balance it out with him. But no, they're going to be sadly mistaken because you're not going to take them back. Okay. This is them wanting to come back and balance out what they did to you. Okay, they, they kept it to themselves at first, but now they want to offer up and say, well, okay, I'm ready to do this right. I'm ready to balance this relationship right. But you might tell me, you know what? No, thank you. I can live my life without you. I don't need you. So you're going to dismiss this person like they dismissed you, like the other person dismissed them. This, this, this. One final card for the collective. What is your person going through right now, now that they are an ex of an ex? Now that their ex left them, What's going on with your ex? Working too hard, too many hours, the need for balance in life, let others help you. Health problems due to stress. They stress the fuck out. They don't know how to handle a broken heart, but they sure know how to diss it. That's what the hell they get. 